So this is a really quick video to show you how convenient and useful the SpeedyB app is when you want to change the motor direction and the motor ordering of your quad that you've just built. Hello and welcome to the Worldly Black channel. While I was building this SpeedyB Master 5 HD, I had to flip the stack through 180 degrees. That meant that the motor direction will have changed and also the motor ordering. Normally the motor order goes one, two, three and four. Because I've flipped it, it's going to be 180 degrees out. That used to take ages to do in Beta Flight Configurator. Now that's all a thing of the past, you use the Speedy B app. So I've got the app loaded here, I've got power on my quad. I'm just going to connect, it's found the board. There we go. So if we select the motors tab and click on reorder motors. And then you get this typical uh, warning to make sure you've got the props off. We need power on here, don't forget. So we just say start and you can see it's just telling me to click on the spinning motor. So that is the one that's spinning. Click that one and this one. And that one's spinning, and that one's spinning. Save. It's rebooted, and now, after all that noise, those motors are now in the correct order. One, two, three, and four. Equally, we can change the motor direction, or just check the motor direction. These need to be going inwards like this. Let's check motor direction. Again, you get the warning. We'll say continue and you just click on the motor. Now that's spinning that way which is the wrong direction. We want them going this way. Change direction. Okay, that's done. Motor 2. That's also in the wrong direction. Not surprised because it's all been flipped around. That's going that way. Correct. Motor 3. That's in the wrong direction. Change direction. That's going that way now, and the last one, motor four. That's in the wrong direction. Change direction, and that's now going inwards. That's it. How straightforward is that? And I really can't emphasize enough how incredibly useful this SpeedyB app is. It connects to the flight controller using Bluetooth, so there's no wires. Doing things like changing the motor mapping or changing the motor direction, as you saw, totally trivial but when you're out in the field you can just use this to change all your PID settings and in fact anything that you could change in Beta Flight Configurator and more importantly you can download the black box logs onto here and analyze them and off you go there we go we've got all your PID tuning as you would like it and if you want to keep up to date with my quad builds or tuning, yeah, you should probably subscribe and turn on the notification bell. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.